Welcome back to Initial Speed. I've got a new thing to teach you. So, it is so easy that even my wife can do it. I said I heard that. <laughs> I am going to teach all of you and my wife how to change out the shifter, the shifter bag and the shifter. So all you're going to do is grab it by here and pull up. Okay, if you can't do that, then grab the bag and pull on the bag. This one's destroyed anyway, so. There you go. Okay, lift it all the way up, like you're lifting your skirt over your head. <clears throat> Now there's this copper piece down here. It's a collar that is supposed to be squeezed to squeeze this white part here to hold it to the shifter because this is actually the shifter rod. But seeing how the last person didn't do that, it's made our work that much easier. So now all you're going to do is pull up on this as hard as you can and don't hit yourself in the face. Ha <laughs> <laughs> That was easy. That's all, that's legit, all I have to do. That's it. Throw it on the ground, because it is garbage. Garbaggio. I need to open the new one. Ooh. Unveiling. I didn't think this through. The sun is now coming out and is very bright. Ooh, very nice. Okay, then what, I literally just... What do you think? No, it's really nice. It, it's like, it's modern too, right? So it's got the black. To go along with the uh, fabric, I'm sure you guys would have seen that in an earlier episode. The uh, suede fabric that I did the back. And now we've got the leather shift boot. And soon, I will take care of that. Okay, so I'm saggy, saggy. Okay. So I'm assuming I do that? Yes. Make sure you put it correct. Oh, see, so it comes with its own its own collar. So what they did was they, oh well, that makes sense, yeah. They just didn't crimp it down, which is fine. How do I do that? I don't have a tool. There's a machine, there, no machine, there's a tool that you use to squeeze this together oh, very okay. tight. Do we have that? Squeeze this together very tight and lock it in. No. And it's fine, because you drove, you drove it without it popping off. I've driven it without it popping off. Install. Um, okay. That's it? Then I just push this. Well, I will. Watch your hands. Okay. Oh. Did it slide off? Yeah. Yeah. No. Okay, well, slide it on for now, and then if it's uh, an issue, then I'll look into it. And then you just put, clip this back in? The same way you took it out. Am I supposed to hear, like, a pop? No, oh, you'll feel it click. Oh, there yeah. you go. I felt that. Come on, use those muscles. <laughs> My thumbs aren't that strong. It's too big. We need some. That's what she said. <laughs> I was gonna say. We need some Vaseline. Oh, really? <laughs> I thought I had a potty mouth. Okay, well, if it's They're not going in, pop the back out and start from the front and oh. see how that works. Okay, I heard the pop there. Are they one size fits all? Yep. All right. Well, you guys get the idea of what needs to be done. Oh, there. It it's plain and simple. There you go. Now. Ooh. Ah. Oh. <laughs> She's beautiful. Yeah, it looks good. And that's it. So that was a short and quick one. Quick, short, same thing, right? Redundancy. That was a short video on how to remove and replace your shift boot and shift knob. Thanks for watching. Initial speed, out.